Hi everyone, we're testing the Spear Gold Dot in 380 ACP, the 90 grain Gold Dot hollow point, using the SimTest Media calibrated to ballistic gel specs, plus four layers of denim. This is my first ever test of the Gold Dot in 380 ACP. We've tested Gold Dots in pretty much all the other popular handgun calibers uh, through a variety of media, wet pack, water jugs and the sim test media also with and without denim but today we're using the sim test with four layers of denim we'll get to that in just a moment this is a bonded bullet you would expect to have uh, no jacket separation with this and we really haven't seen that at all with any of our previous gold dot tests pretty consistent uh, expansion and reliable penetration you want to try to get uh, I'm hoping out of the 380 at least 10 maybe 12 inches out of this Again, the velocities that we can achieve out of this three and a half inch barrel. That's the Bursa Thunder 380 plus. We'll be using this in just a moment at 10 feet into the sim test with four layers of denim. And you're going to see the chronograph specs just before we take that shot. Shot placement sucked. The gun's been shooting left, so I aimed right. Guess what? It went to point of aim. But it's in the block and should be very easy to locate. As is the case every once in a while, it's going to be a tail of two tracks. This is the left side of the block. Point of entry, you can see the denim here. Very similar to the other track we're going to show you here. I cut it off there. Okay, here we go. Point of entry. And we've been seeing consistently some denim that's uh, being blown into the cavity about an inch or two. That's actually uh, coming in about an inch and a half. That's where we are right here. A little bit of a stretch cavity here. It's about two and a half inches in length. And I'd say a little more than a half inch at its widest point. That's the three and a half inch mark. I was really hoping to get 12 inches of penetration out of this. Let's see how close we get as we keep going. Follow the track. And there it is. That's at 10 and a quarter inches on the furthest point here and this block is reversed that actually made a 90 degree turn upward when it stopped let's take a sneak peek at that hollow point cavity before I take this out of the media and I am not seeing any denim in there so that's a good sign and it looks like all the pedals uh, we have pretty much uniform expansion but let's check that out there's the high end on the diameter but the average is 0.517 that's a nice looking bullet. I rinsed out the media, confirmed that we did not have any denim, and a 90 grain bullet's coming in at 90.2 grains. The 90 grain gold dot could be a good performer in 380 ACP. You do need to ensure that this, as well as other loads, will feed reliably in your handgun of choice. I thought we had great expansion. Penetration, well, I may be asking for too much trying to get 12 inches of penetration out of this. And uh, this gel block was calibrated really to the high end of spec, so keep that in mind. But I hope you got some good data points out of this, and thanks again for watching.